नमस्ते देर आर एट प्लैनेट्स इन अवर सोलर सिस्टम दिस इज सैटन वन ऑफ द मोस्ट फैसिनेटिंग प्लैनेट्स सैटन इज ऑल्सो फेमस फॉर इट्स एक्सटेंसिव रिंग सिस्टम डज इट लुक द सेम एज इट रिवॉल्व अराउंड द सन नॉट रियली वी विल फाइंड आउट मोर अबाउट द सेम विद द हेल्प ऑफ दिस मॉडल we will also explore another regular feature that is retrograde motion towards the end the design and build process of the model will be discussed we will not discuss facts and figures about the planet which are easily available elsewhere on the net as usual let us start with the basics Earth takes 365 days or one year to complete one revolution around the sun. During this period, its tilted axis always points at the same location in the sky, popularly known as North Celestial Pole. Saturn in turn takes a longer time that is 10753 earth days or approximately 29.4 years to complete one revolution around the sun just like earth saturn's axis is also tilted but at a different angle during one revolution of saturn around the sun the orientation of this axis does not change This is the main reason why we see its rings positioned differently during its revolution. When Earth has completed one revolution around the sun, Saturn has moved only this much. that is approximately 12 degrees in its orbit another year and another 12 degrees and so on same can be visualized with the help of gears this dial will be the base for our setup for now we will not use any notations on the dial except the months i plan to use another dial but that is something which is work in progress This long arm will hold Saturn while this short arm will hold Earth with the sun in the center. One revolution of Saturn around the sun results in approximately 29.5 revolutions of Earth. To keep it simple, size as well as distances between planets are not to the scale for this model. Alternatively, I can move the Earth and that results in saturn moving forward in its path by approximately 11 to 12 degrees let us add this set of gears on the arm of saturn these gears will ensure that the axis of saturn does not change its orientation with respect to the sun as it revolves in its orbit we will replace this small saturn with a bigger one in this view from the front observe the tilt direction of saturn's axis and its ring it never changes just to recap saturn and earth are said to be in opposition at this location and are in conjunction at this location earlier we have seen retrograde motion of mars and why it happens similarly saturn also displays retrograde motion but it is more frequent once in a year we'll remove the sun and planets from their respective locations
This rod will connect two positions of the planet and will ensure that the line of sight from Earth to the Saturn is always maintained. This arrangement will simulate how we see Saturn from Earth against the backdrop of distant stars. Let us attach a laser pointer here. The left frame shows the top view of the setup, while the right frame shows the front view. In its regular path, this is the direction in which Saturn appears to move, from west to east. But during some specific interval, it appears to move backward for some time and then resumes its regular movement towards east. This happens due to the difference in relative speed of Earth and Saturn. Earth moves faster than the planet Saturn. Retrograde motion takes place with an interval of 378 days. And this retrograde motion lasts for approximately 137 days. As you can see, the motion is apparent when seen from Earth. In reality, the planet is not moving backward as can be seen in the left frame. We can view the same in the Stellarium software as well. Saturn is seen every day at midnight against the backdrop of stars. Red line indicates the ecliptic, while in the backdrop, Pisces constellation can be seen. As we know, the same pattern repeats every year. It just shifts position by approximately 12 degrees along the ecliptic. This is in contrast to the different retrograde patterns displayed by Mars. For superior planets like Mars, Jupiter and Saturn, the period of retrograde motion often occurs around the time of opposition. In a span of 50 years, from year 2000 to 2050, Mars is in opposition 23 times, while Saturn is 48 times. Now let us remove laser and mount this GoPro camera at the position of the Earth. The camera will simulate how we see Saturn from Earth. Though the camera is mounted on Earth, the view is almost the same even from the Sun as Saturn is far away from Earth. View from GoPro can be captured on the smartphone as well. As Saturn travels in its path, orientation of the ring changes. This change is not visible to the naked eye but you will need a telescope for the same. December 2001 Saturn is tilted away from the Sun as well as us. And we see rings and the planet from below. That is, Southern Hemisphere is clearly visible. Fast forward March 2009 Saturn is sideways related to the Sun as well as us. And we see the rings Aegean. These rings literally seem to disappear for some time when seen from Earth. About every 15 years, the rings are nearly invisible from Earth because we are viewing them Aegean and they are so thin that they seem to vanish. June 2017 The planet is tilted toward the Sun and we see the planet rings from above. In this instance, Northern Hemisphere is visible. September 2025 It's age on again and planet is sideways with respect to Earth. After another 8 years, it completes the cycle and position is the same as earlier at this point.
here is a food for thought can you find out how many oppositions will be there with respect to earth in one revolution of saturn give it a try Now let's discuss some design part. Earth takes 365 days to revolve while Saturn takes 10753 days. To simulate this, we need a reduction ratio of 0.0339. This can be achieved with the help of compound gears. This 12th gear will drive the Earth. With 1224 combination, we get half the reduction. While with 1223 combination, we get 0.52 reduction. With 5 sets of compound gears, if we multiply all the individual ratios, we get a desired ratio approximately, which is 26 days less than the actual period of revolution for Saturn. Another factor to consider is the direction of rotation. Both are moving in anti clockwise direction. To maintain this, odd number of axles are ensured in the system. Here is a CAD design followed by actual assembly. During this activity, I used Python based Skyfield library to generate lot of data. Here is the data generated for opposition of Saturn. On an average, duration between two oppositions for Saturn is 378 days. Earlier, in order to keep the laser always on, I used to use this block. This time, instead, I decided to use this small ring. Ring is oval in shape, so by just turning it for some time in different position, I can keep the laser on for a longer period. By turning it backwards, laser can be switched off. Instead of GoPro camera, smartphone can also be mounted in the place of earth. I found this arrangement slightly bulkier and difficult to handle. I had to paint the white ball with grey shade as totally white ball was difficult to capture in the video frame. I added this handle driven mechanism with the help of bevel gears so that model can be operated easily. The very first version I created for this setup was using motor to drive the system but it could not operate successfully due to heavy load and friction. I hope that I was able to convey the reason for changes in ring orientation as well as retrograde motion of Saturn. Thank you.